Well lads, what's the crack? My name is Urgia Runner and welcome back to Resident Evil 3 Part 6. Okay, we got a lot done in the last part, at least I feel we got a lot done. We picked up a note which I didn't get to, it has the safe combination number on it, so, so we're gonna make our way back there and get whatever goodies lie in yonder area. Maybe it's a thing for opening up the little doodads there. What was it? It was 937 if memory serves me right. I'll try it. Right. Nah. Shit. Right. Nine. Left. Three. Right. Seven. I'll be totally impressed with myself if I get it right. Right off the bat. Okay. No, I didn't. Uh, notes, files, 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 files. Oh, that was way off. It's, uh, left 9, right 15, left 7. So left 9. Right 15. Left 7. Boom, there we go. Woo, it's a hip pouch. I mean, not that I really need it. I mean, I've got inventory room aplenty. But thanks for for that anyway. Carlos, the star's office is up ahead. Copy that. Well, screw you. I'm going up the other flight of stairs. You're not dead, are you? Yeah, I knew it. Sir, you're being belligerent. On the ground. <gasps> okay, I want to try and shoulder uh, rush him. Can I get it right? Oh yeah! Oh! Right into the nutsack! Oh! It didn't do any good! Okay, I guess the uh, nutsack part of him is dead as well. Or undead, should I say. Woo! Key! Ah! I think you will be taking that. You're not dead either, are you? Okay, probably not. Ooh, first aid spray, I'll be taking that. Locker. Don't have to code for that either. I mean, for all I know, it could be the same as the one in Resident Evil 2, but I don't want to take that chance. I made myself look stupid. Either way, I can't remember the code from Resident Evil 2, so it doesn't matter. Sir? Gonna get up anytime soon? No? Yeah, didn't think so. Coward. Okay. Okay. Shoulder rush! Oh! Oh, snap, son! You got absolutely wrecked. Let's try it again. Oh, right into the nutsack. Oh! No, 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 no! Jeez, get off. You don't chew on my man meat. There we go. Oh, you're still alive. Oh, get back down. You dead now? Oh, yeah. Dead from the head down? Dead from the feet up. Good, that's what I like to see. And I am on caution yet again. Well, I'm not going to waste my first stage spray just yet. Oh, for fuck's sake. Why is it blocked? Eh, why is anything blocked in this game? Oh, those are my footsteps, thank God. Okay, anything else in here? Ah, not a locker, but you don't have the combination to. Lovely. That is perfect. Note to a friend. Hector, if you're reading this, I'm already dead. If you hear any noises coming from the locker, do not open it. Please. While you're out in patrol, I focused on finding a way to get to the other side. I realized that explosives might be our best bet. I managed to rig up a pretty good bomb, but we don't have any batteries for the detonator. I'm pretty sure I sent one to the safety deposit room during intake last week. We need that battery if we're going to knock this wall down. So I headed upstairs to find you since I know you have the safety deposit room key. As soon as I left the shower room, I was attacked. One of them bit me. 
I washed the wound as best I could, but I feel worse and worse. I hope I don't need to spell out why you must not open the locker. Please don't worry about me. Just get yourself out of here as fast as you can. Your buddy, Wes. P.S. Don't worry about that $600 I lent you. Think of it as a gift towards your upcoming move. Good luck, buddy. Ah, that's sweet. Even in debt. Better not. Yeah, yeah, totally. Oh, this is the room I need to knock down. Or this is the wall I need to knock down. But I don't have the battery for it. Alright, so I have the key for the, um, the safety deposit room. I, is that what it's called here? Excuse me, what the hell is going on there? No, I don't even think I want to know. Okay, this looks way too easy. I'm expecting something to do the oogie boogie and jump around from that corner there. <gasps> I fucking caught it! Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> you can just tell. You can always tell when shit is gonna go down. Okay. If it's just one of them, I should be okay. A headshot should do the trick, right? Oh, get away! Oh no! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Ah. Oh. Shit, son. Oh wait, hold on. I, I think I do have have the combination for this. It's CAP. I saw it below in the uh, other room I was in earlier on. No. It must be for the shower room locker then. Okay, that's right here. CAP. Ah, yeah. Here we go. Ooh, flash grenade. Nothing dropping here now. <laughs> Nothing else here. Ah, okay, fine, we're good. Wait, did I collect handgun ammo from upstairs? Oh, yeah, I did. Okay, good. Now, the thing is, how am I going to deal with the liquor? I mean, I don't have any powerful guns yet. Aside from my assault rifle and my handgun. But I need something a lot better. There you are, dick face. Oh, don't go to mine! He can be blinded? I didn't know that. Good run, son. Okay, let's try another one. Oh! Oh, you got lovely ass cheeks. Time to rip him to shreds. Oh, now you're dead. Great. 99. And hopefully that is the last I'll see of any of you for a while. But I doubt it. Oh, sweet. Oh. I need... I didn't even see you there, buddy. Get back. Back it up, sir. Get away. Back it up. It's looking nice and 
Finish your freaking body! Don't be freaking scaring me. So I still need codes and whatnot for this. Oh, again, I hear another bobbing sound. Oop, there you go. And another herb. And there's nothing in here, so that doesn't really matter. Wait, can I still open these anyway? 104. 104, yeah. And then there's 109 as well, wasn't there? Oh, okay, yeah. So, right. Need this battery. Mine now. 106, 109. Not sure if we can open 106. Come the papa. Okay, so 106, we'll try that. Oh, yeah, we can. 106. You know, you don't really need the keys to open up the lockers. All you have to do is press down the buttons. I mean, it doesn't make any logical sense, really. It's the same with any keypad or keyboard. If I take off the keys off my keyboard, I'll still be able to press down on the keys. Not as accurately, but I'd still be able to press down on them nonetheless. Okay, anything else here? No, no. No, okay. Got everything that I came for. Oh, oh, what's this? The third floor locker, DCM. Yes, that's right. That is right indeed they do, so I'll get what's ever in there as well. Is there going to be another liquor to get in my... Get in my way. On the goddamn ground. Do you not hear me? I said, on the ground! Oh yeah, fucking Carlos. Carlos Punch a Zombie. What's his second name? I mean, we, we have Chris Punch a Boulder Redfield, but what's Carlos' second name? You have to call him Carlos Punch a Zombie something. Back! It probably was mentioned earlier on, but I can't recall. Okay, so D C M. Ooh, more rifle ammo, great. I wouldn't. Because God knows there could be more liquors. Okay, electronic gadget. And what I have to do is combine this with this and boop. Definitely gonna wake the dead with that now. Oh, speak of the devil. Oh, God. Back. Oh, Jesus Christ, that was close. Get up. Getting a bit claustrophobic here, guys. Oh, Jesus. And I, I can't go back. I can't go back. Okay. Get away! 
Oh no, no, no! I'm getting fucking destroyed out here, man. Oh. Jesus. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Get in your girls! <sighs> Dr. Bard. Oh, thank God. Did you know how long I've been trying to reach somebody? Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of there. Just tell me where you are. I'm trapped in a goddamn hospital, surrounded by every kind of abomination. Look, just send in stars. They're gonna know what to do. Now, negative. RPD's overrun, too. Then figure it out! Umbrella's gone crazy. They're killing all the researchers. I am the only one who knows how to make the vaccine to stop the zombies. So you can either sit there with your dick in your hand or send, send somebody who's capable of getting me the hell out of here. I like him already. Yeah, you would. You heard what he said. We can't turn him over to the company. Well, that's not our call to make. That's Mihail's call. I'm gonna check the computer, see if I can trace the doc's location. Okay, you do that while I uh, stay here and die. This will take some time. Look around, see if you can find anything useful. I'll look around, see if we can find. Yeah, what's up? Derailed. Was anyone hurt? Jill? Ah, oh, shit. Wait, what? Jill! Jill, what happened? Jill, come in! T, I gotta go. Do what you gotta. I'll take care of Bard. Okay, I feel like I missed out on a lot of opportunities in that part. Um, shit. And the last save spot was the Raccoon Police Station Dark Room. Back. Um, I'm conflicted here. I'm re I really am conflicted. Yeah, I, I reckon, like, I could have gone around that room, the um, star's office, found some notes and whatnot, possibly from Chris, possibly from Claire or, or Noi. No, this, ta this takes place before the events of Resident Evil 2. No, Chris definitely would have left a note. Um, But, uh, yeah, I definitely missed out on a few things there, because as you saw, I got a bit overrun with zombies and, of course, the uh, clicker. I'm not the clicker, um, I'm, t I'm thinking of The Last of Us. The Crimson Red, is is that what they're called? The Crimson Liquor, so something like, like that. You, you, you know what, what I mean. Um, no, I'll, I'll, I'll leave it. It's too late now. I'll go back and do that in my own time. Oh, but as you can see, shit fairly hit the fan here. And I suppose I can expect Nemesis to start chasing my sweet Carlos? booty sometime Come soon. In. Carlos? Oh, damn it. I guess I'm out of range. Out of range and underground. Okay, so I've got a few collectibles here. Let's just 
Check the shelf. And of course the benches, no, nothing else there. So I can deposit a few things. Okay, like this one useless shotgun shell. Wait, what? Yeah, I'll store that. I'll store the first aid spray. Yeah, I don't want to waste a flame round. I'll take these. Okay, we also got a note. UBCS new weaponry notice. Good news, Nymptix. I've got some new weaponry for you that's guaranteed to put the brass back in your sacks. They're called mine rounds. These babies were developed by Umbrella's military R&D, and they will light your fires even hotter than the lover you left back home. They're tough to find and tricky to handle, but trust me, they're worth it. Alright, let's take a look at the specs. Mine rounds are designed for standard issue grenade launchers. Don't get cute and try to load them in anything else. Fire them at walls or the ground, and they'll stay right there where you put them. The sensor in the mine will detect approaching enemies and detonate when they get within range. So basically, just toss them in the enemy's path and you've got yourself a landmine. There's no such thing as unfair when you're taking on those giant freaks. So get out there and fight dirty. Will do, Cap, will do. And there's some more heater, thankfully. So I'll be using these against old Nemi Baby, will I? Yeah, more than likely. Of course, make another save. As you can see, I've quite a lot of save files here. Seriously, Nemesis is just going to come through, bursting through one of these walls in any second now. Well, I could try the mine rounds, the mine mine rounds right now. Yeah. Boop. Eh, not that impressive. Back to flame rounds we go. But I suppose he got the job done. That's the main thing. Hey, you. You sleeping? Oh, you're dead. Okay. Brilliant. Fantastic. Just what I like to hear. So what? Is this some sort of bunker? Probably. Oh, hey, fellas. There sure is a lot of you, ain't there? Uh, how do you set your world on fire? Oh, there you go. Oh, you seem to be doing all right. Not for long, buddy. Ah, rest in peace. Rest in pickles. Ooh. That is ominous. Is Nemesis going to grab me by the face again? Oh. The walker's still alive. I can't stay here. Escaped a creature. Okay, well, he's nowhere in sight yet. So I feel pretty good about myself. I feel pretty safe for the time being. Hang on, Emma, thank you. I mean, he's gonna pop up any second now. Just you wait. Ooh, herb. Thank you. Oh, can't pick it up. And I'm fine. There's no chance I can combine it with the red and green there. No. Oh well. Okay, anything else? No. No, no, no. I think, I think we're good. Oh, oh, oh. I heard of something. Ah. Sneaky. Uh, very good ears. Very good ears indeed. In dilly do. I don't miss a trick. Okay, so no more herbs, no more nothing around here. Okay, good. 
go oh guide pamphlet enjoy your life st michael's clock tower st michael's clock tower is a baroque style building which stands at the heart of raccoon city it has become a beloved icon and residents consider it to be emblematic of the city as a whole St. Michael's Church erected this tower in 1908 with the assistance of several philanthropists. It was dedicated to the children born in the developing city and the first floor was used as an elementary school for many years. The city saw further growth during its electrification over the course of the early 20th century and the student body of St. Michael's Elementary swelled to over 600 students. Jeez, I was going to say 500 at that time. Unfortunately, St. Michael's Elementary was shuttered in 1978 as the building began to show signs of age and wear. The clock was deactivated and strict limitations were placed on entry to the surrounding premises. Years passed with this once beloved monument and public plaza on lockdown, but in the 1990s the Umbrella Corporation worked in league with Mayor Michael Warren to renovate and reopen the area, this time with proper preservation efforts in place. The clock tower was officially reopened in 1993 and today the sound of its heavy tolling bells can be once again heard throughout Raccoon City. Mm. No, 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 no. Those are the bells of death, doom, and despair. Anything with Umbrella Corporation Incorporated leads to nothing but those three. Carlos, respond. Yeah, what's up? We didn't make it. The train derailed. Derailed? Was anyone hurt? No, everybody's dead. Mihail, everybody. Oh, shit. Nikolai left us to die. Wait, what? What the fuck? It's back! Oh god, it's back, and it's uglier than ever. Oh, criminy Christmas. Beat the creature, how? Oh, I know, landmines. Or flame rounds. Yeah, that should slow you down for a bit. Oh, shit, I missed. Yeah, flame on, buddy. Flame, frickin'. On. More flame time. Yeah, that's right, son. Just right. Now, is there anything else around here I can use? Oh, just got to Sure. No, I don't need to use a herb, but surely shotgun shells. Uh, no. Handgun ammo. Yeah, I can do that. What's in here? More shotgun shells, but I just don't have room. Or do I? No, I don't. Could do with some more flame rounds, though. Jesus, you mad bollocks. Calm down. Ooh, red herb. More handgun ammo. And flame rounds. Oh no, I'm completely stocked up on ammo. Oh! Jesus Christ. Yeah, I won't bother using the herb. Y yes. Fine. I'm fine. You're not fine. Oh, Jesus. 
Let's Nemi get right. Yeah, I'm gonna pick this up and see if I can. No, I can't just use it. Or it's a pity. Okay, there's mine rounds in there. I suppose I can take those. Thank you. Back it up. For some space and whatnot. No respect. No respect at all. <gasps> okay. Now I can definitely free up one more inventory space. Yeah, buddy, lighting your world on fire. Lighting up your life. Jesus. I didn't realize he was that strong. Switch the mine around. I need to stop it in its tracks. Yeah, there we go. Oh! I'm gonna kill you. Oh yeah, there we go. Right, let's do this. Stop it! You know, I'm still fine on the ammo front, and I'm getting even more. But again, I don't think that's the last we'd see of old Nemi. I mean, I wish that was the case. Okay, anything else dropped here now? Wasn't there a herb here before? Ah, uh, yeah, there is. Hmm, yeah, I'll just take ta the ammo and the flame rounds instead. Shit, I wish I hadn't done that. Uh, it's okay, I, I, I think I, I have plenty of heating items in my inventory. Tyrell, do you copy? What's going on? Jill's been infected. I... I'm taking her to the hospital. Maybe Dr. Bard can save her. All right, I'll meet you there. You hang in there. 
Joe. I'm gonna get you the vaccine. You're gonna be okay. I promise. Jesus Christ. Jill, you got absolutely messed up. Oh, like it. I have to get the vaccine, then I give it to Jill. I, I see, I see, I see, I see indeed. Okay, uh, I've been recording for nearly 50 minutes yet again, so I think I'll end this part here. I think this one is going to be one of the shorter parts, but I think it's a good place to leave off. I fought Nemesis, I defeated him again for the, what, fourth time? I forget, I've, I've lost track. Uh, um, I've lost track, I've lost count. Whatever, whatever word you want to use. I've lost how many times I've kicked his ass and survived. Oh boy, but I think we're getting pretty near the end of the game now. How long have we been playing? I've been playing for eight hours. That's not entirely right. There's no way I've been playing for eight hours. No, no, that, that's completely wrong. That's false. Unless it takes into account the amount of time I've spent at the pause menu. It probably does. Oh well. That being said, you know what to do. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment, favorite, share with your friends, and of course, subscribe if you wanna. And I will see you in the next one. So on to next time. See ya.